Hello buddy. Welcome back for another video. <coughs> this time we're gonna go around the, the 160 stacker. I'm kinda gonna show you a little bit about the cannon. And basically all, I, all I'm gonna try to do is kinda show you that the cannon is working. Um and try to make you guys be oops. 140 down should do it better. Now I have this beautiful water right there. Gosh dang it. Undo. There you go. But this is the schematic I got from from the my YouTube channel. And the first mistake right here is a small mistake here. Um this right here is not supposed to be here. These two redstone and repeaters. I don't know what it's doing right there. Um but basically that is just about it. I did did not have a slap down here. Let's put a slap. But I am um, I already checked the cannon and I know it works. Or else I wouldn't do the video. But uh let's just put that right there. And let's go up again and fire the cannon. Uh, let's just make sure there's wet sand in there as well. There you go, that should be fine. And let's just fire this up. And if it works, it should slap bus stack and hybrid. And I'm almost positive it will. Unless my cat, uh, unless my cell fucks up again. But it works just fine. Let's just make sure that it can't clip. Nope. That's no way it can clip. So let's do the same again. Let's paste this in. I already had paste on it. Now we don't need the slap bar, so you can have to disable that since there's no slap, then it doesn't really matter. Works just fine. Now there is a little bit of spawners there. And we're gonna use this dispenser right here. If there's no dispenser, you can just place a dispenser, doesn't really matter. And let's get rid of this right here. And let's. And this whetstone here was probably a repeater on your schematic, so just make it a whetstone, doesn't really matter. Um, right there, you put that, put the staircase up here so you can follow up the whetstone like this. And this is a lot of ticks, and there's only two spawners there, so you can take some of that off. Just leave like one repeater. Um, I'm just about to sneeze here. Achoo! Gotta love it. Um, right now, uh, we need to disable everything. Uh, there you go. There you go. That's that's it. Everything is disabled beside the power and the spawner TNT. So whenever we shoot, it is gonna get rid of these two spawners. So we continue on our wait. That's just one TNT. So. That will definitely do up some spawn off if that's what's the case. So now I'll go in here and make sure you have a free path. And you do indeed. So now comes the question. A lot of videos I kind of showed you how to blast to the, this wall right here. And create a back stack to scatter up and down. But this time I'm probably gonna... Probably gonna do something else here. So let's say they have chests right here they want to protect, and I can of course not use chests because sand definitely breaks on the server on chests. But I'm pretty sure that is disabled on your on your server. But let's just say that this is chests. There you go. If that makes any sense, there you go. And these chests are of course water covered. Um. No, wait. These chests are of course water covered. Uh shit 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 shit. I might have made the roof a little bit too low. Wait, what's all that about? Oh I got one one block up, I see. I see, I see. Um there. let's have the blocks right here. There you go. That's chests, and it is blocked off, so you can't really right-click them to get into them. But you don't want to get the chest. You want to use this as a backboard. Uh, 
inside the base. They kind of helped you a little bit there. So let's try to go up. If you want to go up, you have to go in here. Place a cobblestone right there. I already did that. Of course, I checked. I checked ahead. Place one block right there. I trapped also. Oh, and then make sure there can be a block right there. Or if not, then you fucked up. Um, but as you see right now, it is working fine. Uh, I just tried the the guider and yes, a free passage for it. And you can place a block right there. And that is just about it. When you've done that, you have to enable everything again. And now you can actually go up. Um, I do want to get rid of the wet sand. Because if you made a sand stack, then it might hybrid it down. So I always get rid of the wet sand. Just to be in the safe side, you know. But it should work just fine now. And this one goes all the way up to bedrock almost. This is like a 180 stack or something like that. What happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? Made the test wrong, didn't I? Yeah, I did. <sighs> Supposed to go right here. There. Let's just water call that shit and do it again. Set cobble. Alright. Set up. Oh. Set cobble, there you go. So now you have a you have to make it online in a video cannon of course, or else it wouldn't really work. So when you go here it has to go right here. And if it was up here then you won't be able to reverse scatter because then the water will protect the 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 roof. But normally the chests are not at the roof, it's normally down here and that is what you aim for and then you shoot up. But oh well, I just do it like this. So let's try again. There you go. A minor mistake. Uh, there you go. Now it works just fine. Of course, it, it blew up because when it shoots up uh, right here, the TNT blew it up and there was no water on top of these because I fucked up and I didn't really want to redo it. Don't blame me. Uh, but it was right there, so don't worry about it. How much did it actually blow up? Holy shit, it actually blew up a lot. Oh well, this was still the test. Now that we got this, you can reverse up all you want, by the way. You can go all the way up. I think you go in 180 blocks up or something like that. Uh, when you've done this, and you want to hybrid down, you, of course, put your guider back on. Right there. And you take your scatter. Normally, you would take your scatter on. Uh, just like you normally did. Uh, like that, and like that, and like that. Everything is back to normal, and then you can continue on your way. This way you don't really forget anything. Uh, now you want to disable the scatter, uh, the slap boss, the hammer, because we are, oops, we're going to make a hyper shut down. You can do that uh, changing this to a full repeater, put a full tick on it, and add the slap boss to it, as well as the hammer down, of course. Oh, I'm stupid. Oh, gosh. So about that, you have to need to have the ham on, and you need a slap boss with a full tick on here. I don't know why I did that. There you go. Now you need one ta sand, nothing else than one sand. There you go, and now you should be able to have it down, and you can go all the way down to bedrock with this. So if you aim high, you're probably going into every single base in there. There you go. Every single, every single room in the base, and you can definitely go down there. If you wanted to, because it makes a hybrid shot down there. But I think that is just about it. I don't think there's anything more I can show you. I've shown you how to reverse, I showed you how to throw down a hybrid shot, I showed you just about anything. I don't really think there's anything else I can show you. Um, but as well, as well as you see here, this goes all the way down to bedrock. But I don't think there's anything else I can show you. I'm pretty sure that was the reverse scatter, that was the downward hybrid, that was the cannoning spawners and normal walls, of course, so you know it works. Uh, and I think that is just about it. This was the, let me check, that was the 160 stacker. Um, and if you have any issues with the cannon, feel free to comment, and I will try my best to find a solution. Remember to like my video, and of course, subscribe to my channel for new videos, and keep track of me and support me. And I think that is just about it. My name is Dexter, and I'm out.